Your Sphere. This is Dan, your host. How are ever you, all of you people doing? Well, after episode four, I decided I was going to watch episode five, and then uh, if I liked this, the episode, I would either do a full episode or just continue the season and do it all at once. And yeah, I decided to do the full, the rest of the season because this show went down, and I mean in a flaming garbage shoot. Fuck. <sighs> episode one and episode two, Space Force, was pretty good. Episode three, four, trash. Five, eh, started getting a little better, and then just went nosedive straight into hell. It was fucking horrible. The, the comedy pretty much was gone. It just got cringe as hell. And then the, and the ending was terrible. I'm not going to spoil it in this one. I just... It, it just... It had potential. With episode one and two, the show started off with, you know, mocking everything. It was really good. Five, it does get a little bit of the mocking. It, you know, has that good, you know, com comedian, you know, where they can mock things. And then it just went to hell. Why? I don't understand what the hell happened. You know, it, I'm never a big, big fan of The Office. So for those out there, you know, good for you. I'm glad you guys liked it. I just, I couldn't get into it. It's too fucking boring for me. So this show really went downhill for me. Uh, yeah, it, it, for no reason either, which just sucks. Because it was really good at first. It had a lot of comedy, it had a lot of funny moments, and then it developed this whole thing with China and, and how they, you know, petty little stupid things, and how the government just became absolutely stupid. Like, I get it, you're trying to mock. But it didn't do very well. So, yeah. Uh, sucks because you know I had potential I wish you know we could get a good show with a good story with you know good character development you know the, his wife goes to prison and they never say why ever in the entire se season I'll spoil that they never say anything she, she's in there for 40 years why no idea and they do this whole thing where she wants an open marriage and so he could start dating because she wants to date a lady I don't fucking I don't in prison, I, it just, I was hoping for a good funny show, you know, I'll have to keep looking, I'll find a show soon that I'll really enjoy, and I'll, I'll do it, uh, Witcher was good, I was really happy with the Witcher, but this was trash, it just ended up being complete trash, one and two were fantastic, why couldn't you keep that going, you know, just keep up the, you know, the comedy with a little bit of space humor, with a little bit of, you know, mocking, but don't make it sound like the entire government is absolutely retarded. But China somehow is, they make China look like it's some kind of fantastic, you know, all together government that rules, you know, everybody knows what's going on, they're all smart, they're all talented, but American people are all fucking idiots. Yeah, so I suffered through the last couple of episodes, and then I was just like, yeah, that sucked. The ending was terrible. <laughs> yeah. So, anyways, everybody out there, hope you're having a fantastic day. Hope you all had a great Father's Day yesterday. I spent the weekend off of, my, off of social media because I was just sick of all the shit that's going down in our country, the clown world, as as like to call it. Sick of it. So, and I just wanted to spend time with my family. And my brother came down into town, so I went and spent time with him. And it was pretty good. You know, and just had a, a good break. You know, so. But I'm back. I'm, I'm going to keep on making videos, no matter how crappy he's <laughs> okay. uh, People want me to watch Dark. I might watch that next. I'm going to look around, see what I want, want to watch. 
Um, I did finish uh, Return of the King, the book, the audio book. I ended up just getting the audio book. So I'll, I'll do a review on that soon. I hope you, you know, you'll enjoy that. Saying it's still by Rob Inglis. And I hope you all are doing well. I know if the, the guy who played Frodo in Lord of the Rings had passed away. Or not Frodo, I'm sorry. Bilbo passed away recently. So, you know, it's a sad day to see that happen. He was a good man. And, you know, we keep losing the greats. And it's sad to see. All right, you all enjoy. I'll stay safe, stay healthy, and just be good to each other, all right?